Hi, my name is Vijay Chetra and today I am going to give you a brief introduction about the, the new HP Indigo 6K Digital Labels and Packaging Press. We have installed this press at Technova Tech Center here in Mumbai today. Uh, so, I will start from this part of the press. This is basically the unwinder of the press. It is a narrow press. You can put a 13 inch width substrate roll here. This unwinder can take almost 1000 mm or up to 270 kg weight of the roll. So from here, the, whichever substrate you want to print, you are going to load from here. So it can take from 12 micron to 450 micron. This press can print. So when you are printing a job and you want to change the substrate, here is the area where you can actually cut and then paste a new substrate and you do the slicing and then if we move from here we come to this part of the press this is the inline priming unit so anything that you print on this machine it has to be pre-primed so this priming unit with a special kind of primer in this machine and then before that we do corona treatment then we do priming then there is a hot air drying mechanism thing in the press I think you will be inside the inline priming unit. This is the water where you have the corona, priming and water. So, I do it. We come to this part of the press. There is a bridge which connects the inline priming unit and the, you know, the substrate comes here. This is the HP Indigo 6K digital labels and packaging press. You can see the inside of the press, it's a, it's a very strong, robust machine of 7200 kilograms. The technology that which is used in this machine is liquid electrophotography technology. And how it is different is basically this is a single shot printing technology. So what happens in a single shot printing? There is a plate cylinder in the machine. If the blanket cylinder is in the machine, then there is an impression cylinder in the machine. Now what happens in the single shot printing, we put all the colors onto the blanket. So we image everything onto the photo imaging plate and one by one all the colors are getting transferred onto the blanket. Now one color, two color, three color, four color and seven colors which are on the blanket in a single shot. In one go, they will all get transferred onto the substrate, which means your printing will be always, you know, the registration will be perfect because we are registering everything onto the blanket. We are not registering onto the substrate. I will show you this part of the press. This is a seven color press. Uh, we have installed six inks, but we can actually put seven uh, inks. Cyan, magenta, yellow, black, orange, wallet, green, one option. Or you can have cyan, magenta, yellow, black, white, some special pantone color or invisible ink. Or you want to use some fluorescent ink. Or you want to use all colors different. There can be n number of permutations and combinations. There are almost 40 different varieties of inks you can use. And then beyond that you can also use any spot color, we can actually custom make colors for you. This is seventh color if you look at, it will be four process colors and then seven process colors. You cover almost 97% of the color gamut. What is left in that 3% is with the special, you can cover with special ink. Which means, you want a gap blue, you want blue color red, or you want that detailing green, then you can actually put and fit in it with color of this color. And then we also have whites. When you want to print on uh, transparent substrate, you want to print on colored substrate, or you want to print on metallized substrate. So the paste gets mixed into the imaging oil and it becomes a liquid ink. And it is it gets pumped here and we write the image electrophotographically and one by one all the colors they come and you know imaging happens. So I want to take this part of the press. Now this is the, you know, the, uh, this is the area from where you control 
the mechanism of the press where you see how the, the machine is functioning. This is the place where you know the operator of the press will manage the entire thing. This part of the press is we have a very special which is uh, a device or a mechanism which is new in this machine is digital spot master. Now what digital spot master does is for example if you are a brand you are coming to an HP Indigo user and you say that my color, my this purplish green or some special brand color, I want to print. And if you are able to produce that color in less than 5 minutes, if we claim that with the whole mechanism of digital spot master, there will be a scanner which will scan the values of the color or customer tells that this is the color that you have to use, the values of the color. You can incorporate the LAB values of the, the machines that, the conventional machines that you are using for printing that job. Now when you tell that this is the color, in 2 to 5 minutes, this machine can give you that color. What it will do is, it will print, scan, adjust, print, scan, adjust, print, scan, adjust, maybe in a wastage of just 10 to 15 meters and 2 to 5 minutes it will give you that brand color. Now what happens is that when your registration is never out because you are registering onto the blanket and your color you are achieving in 2 to 5 minutes the kind of you know you are going to actually minimize the startup wastage so much that it is going to be a very good uh, you know, solution for short run and on demand printing. Now, from here we come to this part. This is the rewinder. Whatever we are printing, we have to rewind because in digital printing, the finishing has to happen near here. So, after this, you want to use, you have done a job of 300 meters, 200 meters, 500 meters, you can just Rewind and you take that role for finishing. Yeah.